You guys hear a low growling sound? It's probably nothing. Hey everyone, it's your captain speaking, and welcome to Lost in the Back Rooms. Now, yesterday we just played a game, or we just played three scary games where the, in the middle one was uh, called Back Rooms, or Back Rooms of Reality. And uh, I just think it's a, an extremely fascinating subject, um, this liminal back room situation. So, let's try another one. Okay, in this one we're just straight into it. There's no, uh, there's no rhyme or reason why we're here. I'm, I'm going to assume that we're stuck in a nightmare. Oh, okay. Well, thank you. How convenient. I didn't want to go further down anyway. Will you open for me too? Nope. Hello? If you're listening to this, I'm sorry. You're probably wondering where you are right now. The short answer is, nowhere good. Well, we knew that. Somewhere back in the real world, you went through a door that wasn't a door, or you clipped through a wall like a glitch in some game. And now you're here, in the place they call the back rooms. I'm leaving behind these tapes in the hope that maybe someone finds me, or I can help others find an exit. Where did you find the tape recorder? Keep your wits about you, uh, there are things wandering these halls that want you dead or worse. Uh, well, I'd rather be dead than be tortured. Please kill me. Oh, I like the music. So, are we going up or down? Is this the fish game again? Are we going up or are we going down? That's the question. Let's go down this time. Is that something I should be concerned about? The shadows on the ceiling? I suppose not. Keep going down. I feel like I'm in a hotel, honestly. Oh, this looks familiar. I wish I could just tell you where to go, but it's no use. I tried to draw a map and only gave myself a headache. This place has a mind of its own. I think I can hear it moving, even now. Doors where there weren't doors before. Well, this is a big help. Can I take this with me? Because, I mean, look. I mean, it, it's obviously the answers are all right there. It's easy to see. It's, it's, we're supposed to go right here. All right, let's go. No, oh, nope. See, I'm, the map was a lie. Oh. This is it. This is it for this floor. Okay. Well, this is new. Oh, they didn't finish doing the wallpaper in this one. Ooh, they got a lot of work to do. Yeah, I don't want to go back upstairs. The last thing I remember is the drone of the yellow lights. I was at the old gas station finishing a smoke by the dumpsters. The next thing I knew... I felt myself falling back through the wall behind me, like it wasn't even there. When I got up, I was in a labyrinth of yellow rooms, and something inhuman uh, was shambling in the next hall, just barely at the edge of the site. I was too shocked to scream. That might have saved my life. You're probably right about that old buckaroo. Buckaroo bonsai. I think the problem with this game, I, it, I like it so far, but I think the, the issue with uh, it being tied to uh, liminal spaces is that it's too narrow. I think the hallway, like this, is a little better, but I, I think a lot of these hallways are too narrow to be considered uh, as liminal as they could be. Yeah, I'll be honest, I, I kind of just want to see what's making the noises. I, I, I just... I, interested to see what it looks like. I mean, I'll probably die from that. That's a chance I'm willing to take. Oh, the... Okay. I tried turning back, but there was no back. There was no way back. I can only pray that there's an exit somewhere. 
Something tells me it's deeper down in the dark back rooms. I told you we were going the right way. And intuition that I can't explain. Let's hope I'm right. Well, you've been here longer than me, so I'm going to listen to your wisdom and keep going down. Oh, see, that don't make any sense. I told you these were, I told you these were fake windows. Actually, no, I, I thought these were think, fake windows. I never said it out loud, but... Is that my cat dying? I don't own a cat, so it makes it even more freaky. I hope you brought a flashlight. It gets dark ahead. If not, well, all I can say is, good luck. Maybe just keep a hand out in the dark and pray that they can't see you either. Oh, thank God I brought a flashlight. You know what? No. No, the, that guy was a gas station attendant. I was I was not. I don't know where I was from. Um, it would have made more sense if he had a lighter. But just because the gas station attendant was smoking, he would have a lighter. Um, maybe I'm a police officer. I don't know who else would... Uh, maybe a mechanic or a... I don't know, maybe a janitor would have a police op or <laughs> Maybe a janitor would have a um, flashlight. Who knows? I'm going to go with janitor. Janitor out of college. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds about right. What is this, the ballroom? Do you guys hear a low growling sound? It's probably nothing. I'm, I'm refusing to go up. I'm not going to go up anymore. The secondary ballroom. This one has a tape player in it. I think I place can read my mind. I had a memory of a spider bite when I was at 10. Next thing I know, I hear little legs crawling on the floor. Whatever it is that scares you most, don't think about it to the here. Oh, great. Fucking Pennywise in these hallways. That would actually be frightening. I would, uh, not gonna lie, I would probably, uh, probably poo poo my pants. Bah, I think I've been here already. Yeah, I'm not going this. I'm not doing it. I'm not going up. You know, this should be an SCP as well. This should be like, uh, SCP 87 C. Because B is the, uh, infinite basements, I think. And this should be like C, the infinite hallways. That would be cool. Oh, there's some down, I think. Yes! Ooh, more down. No, I'm not going to comment on the baby crying. Or whatever the hell that is. If you're listening, good job making it this far. I really mean that. A little bit of hope can go a long way down here. Take a breath. Forgive yourself for all the times you almost gave up. You know that every step toward you took forward took courage. Keep it up and it might have a chance. Ooh, the lights came back on. Thank God. Still haven't seen the creature. I'm looking forward to it. No. I refuse. Well, that didn't sound good. We may not be able to go down any further. Oh, maybe. Hold on. Nope. I think we're going to have to go up. Yeah, there's no way around it. We, we have to go back up. Don't really want to. I spent the last seven or eight hours just pushing on walls. Sounds stupid now, but I was hoping to clip out of this, of this place the same way I clipped into it. Since you're still hearing from me, you can guess how well that went. How'd it go? So far, no threats. Just a bunch of noises. Oh, I came from here. Uh. Oh. Shit, I thought this was... I have no idea. I got lucky, relatively speaking. Had a couple days of food and drinks 
in my pack in preparation for a few days traveling. I've been trying to ration it, but I'm starting to get dizzy. Not sure anyone if I'm seeing shapes in the dark or imagining at them. I feel like I've been here. This all looks familiar. At first I wished I'd uh, brought a weapon. Now I'm not so sure. I'm almost certain I would have used it on myself by now. It's a dreadful thought, but I can't help wondering. If I die here, do I become one of those things? What things? I want to see them! Show yourself. Show me. Show me what you look like. Hello? Hello? What was that? Sure. Why not? I don't know where the hell I'm going. It's following me. Dear God, it's following me. It's not following me. I think you're just unlucky. Or they don't like you. They seem to like me just fine. Maybe they're attracted to your food. Because I don't have food. I don't think. I got a flashlight. Don't have any food. Where the hell are we? We're in a jail cell now. Looks like we're in, looks like we're in a prison. Is... Is this hell? You know, I wouldn't be surprised. Stephen King did say hell is repetition. Ooh, this room looks fun. I think I'm getting close to the source. Of what? I can feel a pool that I can't explain. Something's drawing me further down to the center of all this madness, and maybe my way out. Probably not. I can only hope I find it before something else finds me. I highly doubt you're headed to the way out. I'm just... Maybe I'm pessimistic, but... Okay, well, no, he's he's just, he's remaining an optimist, and that's, that's a good thing. That's positive. I need more positivity. This is different. Oh, hey! Friendo, uh, what happened to your legs? Dear God, what happened to your legs? Get to, uh, my legs, help! Nope, they're just saying gibberish now. Where? God, I wish I could crouch and get on this table. Could flip the table over and use it as a shield. Use this cover. I'll take you with me. Are your arms gone too? Or are they just clipping through the floor? <gasps> Did your hands find the way out? They clipped through the floor. Follow the hands. Get in there. No, I think he's dead. And we're probably dead too. Jan, the haunted PS1 summer. That was good! I liked that a lot! Very entertaining. Uh, a feeling of dread the entire time? Very good. Jan Malachek? Very nice. Loved it. Good stuff, dude. Or girl. Jan. Developer, you did a good job. Very nice. If you guys liked that video, please hit like and subscribe and leave a comment. And I will see you guys in the next one. Stay toasty, everybody. See ya!